Hi, I've got Fobo Extra here today and Fobo Extra is a new addition to the Fobo Tire and the Fobo Tire Plus set. So what Fobo Tire Extra is essentially is an extra sensor that you can use it to monitor your spare tire or air suspension or anything else yeah, besides the main four wheel. Uh, one thing uh, we have to note is that Fobo Extra only works if you have a set of Fobo Tire or Fobo Tire Plus. You cannot buy a Fobo Extra sensor alone and use it. So in this video, I'll show you how to pair the Fobo Extra sensors as a, a spare sensor to existing car that I have. So I have a set here paired called the Jaguar. Yeah, these are the four main tires. And then if you realize that uh, in, this, in this new app layout, we have two new tabs. This is showing the main tire and we have an extra tab showing the extra tires. So I tap on this uh, extra tires tab and here it says add extra. So I tap on that. Yeah. So um, if you're used to the uh, uh, football pairing, it will ask you to fill up a few key info that you have to do it. Yeah. I'll click OK. So I'll type in the uh, tire name. So I'll put this as Jaguar Spare it's Tire. Okay. Um, I need to set the recommended pressure of this spare tire. I'll put it to uh, 420. This is the recommended pressure for my spare tire. Yeah. So when you notice, if I change the uh, recommended pressure, the min and the max would change by itself. Yeah, exactly how the uh, app is working now. I can override the uh, min and max manually. So I can choose it as I want. I can also choose the min and max. But anyway, I'll go back to the default. 420. So now when I click done, I've set the um, name of the um, sensors that I want to pair with the recommended pressure. So okay, I click done now. It says please install sensor on tire and touch your sensor with the phone. So now I install this spare sensor, the four back extra sensors to the spare tire. Just the car. Tire is. This is the spare tire. Yeah. So I'll screw this four by extra sensor onto the spare tire. Once it's screwed on, hold the phone next to the sensor. Tap on OK. Done. So I've installed the... Uh